Hi, uh, <laughs> Dax39 here. I'm um, basically working on a 3D printed project. I've never done 3D printing before, so I'm a 3D, 3D printing noob. So I thought I would show you what I'm doing for anyone else who's never done it before. I can't build models yet using 3D software. I'm still learning. So what I have been doing is downloading um, files that are already available. So this file here uh, is uh, an Iron Man Mark III helmet um, that I'm building. I'm building a Mark VI costume completely. I thought, by buy a 3D printer, most people spend the first year printing tiny little models that came free with the printer. I jumped straight in there uh, and started building helmets. This here, uh, the file will be in the description. When you build things, obviously, they, you build them in small pieces and then you've got to attach them all together. Went online, did lots of research and um, found the number one glue, the number one um, uh, super glue to use. This glue here. This is the best glue for sticking PLA plastic together. I've used that first to glue the pieces together. Now this is two separate prints um, and I've got a seam from where, because I haven't I probably haven't got my 3D printer um, dialed down 100% um, yet because I'm still learning. As I said, totally new to this. I went online and did some research and everyone is basically saying the two things to use are super glue and a 3D printing pen. I thought this was a gimmick at first. 3D printing pen? <laughs> Sounds crazy. Um, so went on to Amazon and a Digi Hero pen. Uh, this was supposed to be £140 and it was 30 quid in the sale. So I thought, why not get one and give it a test? Um, a lot of people online say um, the best thing to do is get lollipop sticks or if you can't find any lollipop sticks, go to a coffee shop. They have these little stirrers for your coffee. So buy yourself a coffee and take a handful of these. And what people are doing is they, um, what people are doing is they're taking these and they're getting hot glue and they're hot gluing them in to bridge the seams, to bridge the bits that are attached in the helmet. So my idea is uh, when this is done, I was keeping this piece as one piece. I was going to put some magnets in the front. So the jaw, once I've put the helmet on, I can magnetize the jaw on. And this section will have a mechanism to flip it up and down. Uh, once again, found the files for the mechanism to move. Um, but the person who designed it hasn't put any sketches up or anything. They've written a, an idea of take this arm, take that arm, put them together, do that, jobs are good and And I'm looking at all these little pieces like, I have no idea. So uh, when I do put it together, work it out, I'll make a video. Let's find out how good one of these 3D pens are. So I'm going to use my new DAC 79 purple. You might see my icons, everything's changed from a yellow to a purple. So I'm going to use purple against the uh, the silver, that's the, the free rolled plastic that came with my printer, um, so we can at least see what it does. First things first, I guess I've got to heat the 3D pen up. PLA again. All right, it's heating up. It's like a, like a glue gun. Okay, so it says it's at 200. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay, so there we go. So let's find out how this works. So <laughs> it's the way I'm just going straight into it. Uh, okay. Right, okay, so little circles. I can smell it welding them together. Oh, 
Okay. So I'm just going to slow set in. I'm just welding it together like a little welder. Oh man, you can actually kind of see the, uh, the plastics welding together as well. So, so I'm guessing you could sand it down a little bit afterwards. So it has been a very slow. Okay, I've just welded a line across. I'm pretty sure that's going to be better than the glue gun because the plastic seemed to have uh, attached themselves. Right, so setting two on this seems to be the best. And that's definitely the way forward. So. I'm doing the seams on the inside. You could probably fill a nice big void somewhere with that and then sand it down. But I think filler would be the best option. So, there we have it. Let's just remove that from there. There we have it. Trying out 3D pen for welding PLA plastic together. And I would say it's a highly successful first attempt as it PLA plastic, stick it together with super glue, that glue, and then masking tape it together, hold the parts together, and then use a um, 3D PLA plastic pen to weld the insides together. And then I guess there's any areas on larger pieces, when I get to the chest and stuff, I'll probably use the glue gun as well to to do that in as well. The fact that the heat of the glue melts the plastics together and helps bond them. All right, well, I hope that helped anyone out there who's thinking about using one. That's it, nine out.